General Curtis Lemay requested a modification for the A-12 Oxcart from Lockheed in 1961 in order to develop an extended-range deep penetration bomber that the Russians would not intercept. This request resulted in the development of the YF-12 prototype interceptor, which in turn sparked a purchase order for the XB-70 Valkyrie Mach 3 strategic bomber. But following the cancellation of both bombers, the SR-71 Blackbird said, my time has come, and began to gain popularity. When the US learned that Russia's nuclear arsenal building had been overblown and that they were not on the verge of developing a supersonic bomber, the fears of a third world war began to fade. However, this prompted the Skunk Works to produce 31 SR-71s. The U-2 spy plane, which flew high but moved much more slowly, had been deliberately targeted for replacement by the A-12. The F-106 Delta Dart interceptor, which was intended to be the ultimate interceptor, was to be replaced by a new fighter, but rapidly developing aviation technology quickly revealed that the F-106's Mach 2.3 top speed wasn't really that ultimate.